good day friends it is me hl mod tech and i'm back with another lesson for you today my friends i noticed on twitter that people students kids are putting rainbows in the windows just to give everybody a little bit of extra optimism when they're strolling by so i said hey what if we tried to make a rainbow circuit in tinkercad so let's get cracking so of course the first step is to get to tinkercad but instead of designs i want you to go to circuits we want to create a new circuit and when it launches let's start by naming it rainbow and then of course put our initials after it we're going to build our circuit with a breadboard small so bring that dude out and we're going to do it with a 9 volt battery because later we're going to want a lot of juice when it comes out hit rotate so that it's standing up move it close so it's arranged the way you want and let's start by connecting the positive to the positive I always like to make the wires match so red goes to red and black goes to black for this project I want to use a push button so I'm going to drop the push button in right here and then I'm going to connect the positive to the first leg of the push button I'm going to move the second leg out a little bit and we got to add a resistor when you bring out your resistor you need to rotate it and then we're also going to change its characteristics. When you click on the empty space and then the resistor, you can see what it is set at. I want you to go to ohms and I want you to make it 100. Kind of funny that I did 1000 because when it was a kilo ohm, that is 1000 ohms. Next, let's bring out our LED. And we need to switch it so the cathode is on the negative rail. So simply click on it and rotate it till it spins around and it'll be underneath like this. And then just for our first test, you can connect it. I'm gonna make this wire black just cause I like that technique even though we're gonna delete it. Now when we hit start simulation, if you've got your wires all lined up, it'll turn on and it doesn't explode because we've got the resistance set where it needs to be. Now I said we wanted to make a rainbow, so let's hit stop simulation. We can delete this. Click on our LED and do control C to copy and control V to paste it, making sure that you put them staggered one row over. And do that all the way up, making sure you're always moving one row over, one row over, one row over, one row over, and now we're going to go down so it's kind of like a rainbow they get kind of hard to see when they're down here and then once again connect the cathode to the negative rail and then this is the moment of truth when you hit start nothing happens and what it is is there is not enough juice to power all those leds or we could have missed a row we're going to assume it's not enough juice, and then we'll back up and double check the Mr. Row. To get more juice, we are going to stop simulation. We are going to bring out another battery. Rotate it like you did the other one. Bring it across. We're going to delete the positive wire and connect this positive to this. And then we're going to connect the negative and the positive wire. So now there are two batteries that are joined in series. Once again, I'm going to make this wire red. I'm going to leave this wire green since it's going between the two different colors. It's mixed. Let's hit start and see if we get some electricity. And we do. Now you can play with your resistor. If you change that to 50, you can check to see if they get brighter or you may explode them. Uh, I'm going to just for giggles switch back to the tiniest amount of resistance as I can. And they actually didn't pop. I thought they were going to pop. So now my friends the challenge is to make it look like a rainbow. All you do is put in your colors. Now it won't look totally like a rainbow because it's just staggered. And they're missing a few cool colors like violet. But there's your red, your orange. The next would be yellow. You can impress your art teacher and do the next few without me. 
or you can just watch. We'll do the green and we'll wrap it up by putting blue or indigo for the last one. And then when you hit play and hit your button, you have made a sweet little rainbow. Alrighty friends, so there you have it. A sweet little circuit that lets you learn how to connect batteries in series and make something kind of like a rainbow. Friends, if you've got any questions or comments, you can add them down below. You can also keep your eyes peeled for my Discord server. It will be in a link in the description. And if you complete something awesome and want to show it off, make sure you share it with me at HL Montech on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. And of course, if you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.